we head right into our 8.30 high beam. And we are privileged this morning to talk to Suzanne Moore, who is a banking officer and cash management specialist with First Federal Community Bank. Suzanne, good morning. Thanks for being here. Good morning, Brad. Thanks for having me. Yeah, that's our pleasure for sure. As uh, we bring you in, and I uh, kind of revealed your title there. So what exactly at the uh, First Federal Community Bank does a banking officer and a cash management specialist do? Well, the most important part of, of those titles is the fact that I'm the cash management specialist, which means that I work with all of our business customers to make sure that they are in the type of accounts that they should be in and have all the services that they need to help their businesses run efficiently. All right. Well, that makes plenty of good sense. <laughs> so, um, And you talk about uh, getting them in the right places. So the bank obviously has all kinds of remote technology for business customers. Uh, what are some of the or the most popular one or ones that are being used by most of your customers now? Well, most of our customers really enjoy being able to bank from their own offices. And we um, are able to have that occur for them by using uh, a remote technology called remote deposit capture, where the particular business can have a scanner installed by myself in their actual office. Um, And that could even be a home office for some of the smaller businesses. Yeah, good. And they don't have to make a trip to the bank, and they can scan their checks each day. That's really good thinking. And I, I know... The technology is really moving along, so you guys are probably, uh, you know, studying and, and figuring out things as we go, aren't you? Absolutely. We're set to launch a new product in May, so we're real excited about that, and you'll see more about that uh, with our marketing. So it's just another option for our business customers, and this particular new product is a fraud mitigation tool that's really going to help them steer clear of all the different types of fraud that are out there in the world nowadays. Wow, we all are looking forward to that, so that's really good. So uh, in working with the businesses, uh, you provide merchant credit card services. So do the uh, business people get to uh, accept Apple Pay, other forms of payments? Is that How's that working? They sure do. We have several different ways that they can accept credit cards. They can do that, like you just mentioned, Samsung Pay, Apple Pay. They can have a traditional terminal in their business. And we also have uh, mobile options. Um, I have several people who have the type of business where they deliver items, and so they're able to take the credit card payments right upon delivery. And then we also have a really great option, which is an online browser for those businesses that don't um, actually have people coming in. It's not a retail-type business. It might be a manufacturer and they can take credit cards from their vendors over the phone or their customers over the phone and uh, take them that way, too. Well, that's fantastic. So people really don't have to go to any particular offices to pick up on these services then? They don't. They can call me, and I can meet them at their business. That's typically what I do. We have an initial uh, conversation on the phone, or I can meet them at any of the branch offices that are con- that's convenient for them. Suzanne Moore from First Federal Community Bank. And uh, we doc- talked a little bit before we went on here, Suzanne, about the growth of First Federal Community Bank. And uh, since you've been there and seen this, and uh, it's almost like an explosion, isn't it? It really has been, Brad. It's been phenomenal. I've been with the bank for nearly six years now, and the growth has just been um, going higher and higher. Um, and that speaks toward the need that we had to, I think we have, um, well, we re- just redid our um, branch location in Sugar Creek and put a beautiful new building out there. Uh, we have a location in Mount Hope that we didn't have when I started. And, of course, we have the administrative and community building in North Dover. So it's really, a, the growth has been great. And I just think that people really understand that the customer service is our product. Yes, we have all the same products and services that other banks have, but we pride ourselves on our customer service. Well, and that's what makes a difference when you can be with the people and make them happy. So speaking of that, if someone, especially business-oriented, would like to get in touch with uh, the bank or especially you, how's the best way to do that? Well, the best way to do that is you can call me directly at 330-440-0072. Or you can email me at smore at firstfed.com. That sounds good. And uh, you'll be able to answer just about any one of our questions. Is that right? 
Well, I'll do my very best to do that. <laughs> Put you on the spot there. <laughs> All right. Well, hey, thanks a lot. Uh, again, use those uh, ways to get a hold of Suzanne. And I'm sure, like you said, customer service is uh, what you guys are about. So you'll be glad to talk to just about anybody, wouldn't you? Absolutely. Give me a call or email me, and we'll see how we can help you. Suzanne, we really appreciate your time that you took with us uh, here this morning. And uh, maybe we can have you back again, okay? Sounds good. I'll look forward to it, Brad. All right. Hey, thanks a lot. Thank you. That is Suzanne Moore. She is a banking officer and cash management specialist with First Federal Community Bank and our guest this morning here on the BT Morning Show.